Hello and welcome back to Richard Bolzelich's Get Strong at Tsuji. Today we're going to be going over the first set of the advanced problems. Starting with problem number 41, Black is looking to capture these three stones. And the question for Black is, how does he do this? Black's move is the wedge here, and if white Ataris, then Black will descend. Uh, this is the two stone tower Tsuji. Uh, black or white will then Atari this, black will force capture, and then throw in, and now these stones are dead. Moving on to problem number 51, black is looking to kill these six stones in the corner, and again the question is how does black do this? Black's move is the simple crawl here, and if white honeys here, then black will clamp on the 2-1, and this is the, the real key point here, because white cannot live now. Uh, if white descends, then uh, black will throw in here, and it's a snapback. White also cannot just simply connect, because then this is Atari, and uh, yeah. Problem number 52, black wants to capture these three stones, and again the question is, how does black do this? Black's move is the attachment here, and if white Han is on this side, black will Atari this stone. From here, white will again Atari here, and this is the two stone tower to Suji again. White will Atari from this side, black will Atari these two stones, forcing capture, and then black will throw in. And then when black comes back to connect, these stones are going to die. Moving into problem number 69, black is looking to capture these two stones. How does black do this? Black's move is the simple descent here. Uh, this is a really good move because it also prevents or uh, protects against this cut. From here, white may try to jump in here, but if black simply does this move, white cannot connect here because black will descend here and put these stones on Atari. So white needs to pull back, and from there, black can play this move, which is a throw in snap back. Moving on to problem number 70, black is looking to connect these two groups of stones up underneath this. And the question for black is how does he do this? Black's move is the nose to Suji attachment here. And if white tries turning here, black will go here. If white turns here, then black will go here. Um, and then after this one, white needs to start the capturing race because this group is down to two liberties. So white will Atari from this side after which black will take our liberty off of this one, atari -ing this. White is forced to capture, and then black can Atari these stones. White is forced to connect, and so black stones are linked up. Moving on to problem number 72, black is looking to capture these four stones. How does black do this? Black's move is the diagonal move here, and because of this, white cannot win this capturing race. If white plays here to poke at this, then black starts this capturing race by honeying here. If white Ataris, black simply connects. And because this group is so short on liberties and this one would be self Atari, white needs to connect here before uh, he is able to take this Atari, and this would be self Atari dude on this side, so black wins the capturing race. So that is it for the fourth set covering the advanced problems. Thank you so much for watching. If you guys liked the video, please do like it. If you're new around here, subscribe. And if you have any questions, comments, feedback, or suggestions, please leave them below. Thanks again so much for watching, and we'll see you guys in the next video.